Today there are nearly 9 million children with access to education. There are still, and I think that um, the conversations that I've had with all of the other... In some respects, uh, this is a case that is so compelling that the international aid effort will need to continue whatever the scenario. And we're looking at different scenarios. We're looking at a scenario where peace emerges. We're looking at a scenario where uh, there is a reduction in violence. We're looking at a scenario where the current stalemate, if you will, continues. So whichever scenario we've looked at, the simple truth is that international aid is desperately needed in the case of Afghanistan and has to continue. وقتی که خارجی ها برن مواد ها که کم شد باز هم انتفلای ما زیادتر خراب میشه انتفلای داریم که بسیار بیوزد هستن وفیت مریضای ما بیشتر میشه یعنی زیادتر میشه وفات میکنن از سبب امی کمبوت ویتامین ها و بسیار مشکل های زیاد دارن بچه مسر به بقار و شده گفت روسی را لکه دیره بولی گفت روسی با درد منو میخرم ای را میبرم و خالق رخ بخواد سرش کنه این مذاکراتش باید قسم باشه که منافع مردم افغانستان در نظر باشه آزادی بیان در نظر باشه آزادی های مردم حفظ فرهنگ مردم افغانستان اینا را مردم امریکا باید خصوصا حکومت ترامپی را در نظر داشته باشه و اگر آقای ترامپ بخواد ما را به قرون وسطایی سودا بکنه اختیار به اوناست I would hope that every capital uh, stays the course uh, with the people of Afghanistan as they go through um, yet another trying moment. And, uh, you know, I think there's a, a dictum in the case of Afghanistan at the beginning of every year. People say this is going to be a big year in Afghanistan. I would suggest that 2020 is quite possibly the biggest year that Afghanistan has yet to face.